Pythagorean numerology, rooted in the teachings of the ancient Greek philosopher Pythagoras, emphasizes the spiritual significance of numbers and their relationships to the cosmos. From an occult perspective, Pythagorean numerology is often associated with esoteric and mystical interpretations of numbers, believing that numbers hold inherent qualities and vibrations that influence various aspects of life and existence. In Jewish mysticism, particularly within the tradition of Kabbalah, numerical symbolism plays a significant role. Kabbalistic teachings attribute mystical meanings to numbers, viewing them as conduits for divine energy and pathways to understanding the universe's hidden mysteries. The most well-known system of Jewish numerology is gematria, which assigns numerical values to Hebrew letters and words. By analyzing the numerical equivalence of words and phrases, practitioners of gematria seek deeper insights into spiritual truths and divine connections. From both occult and Jewish mystical perspectives, numbers are seen as symbols of cosmic harmony, divine order, and spiritual enlightenment. Practitioners may use numerical analysis for divination, meditation, or gaining insights into the nature of reality and the human soul. Ultimately, the interpretation of numbers in Pythagorean numerology and Jewish mysticism reflects a belief in the interconnectedness of the physical and spiritual realms, where numbers serve as keys to unlocking deeper truths about existence. Numerology can be used to target the subconscious pattern recognition of the human mind through the manipulation of numbers and their associated meanings focusing on the negative aspects of the numbers 9 and 11. Here's how. Repetition. By repeatedly exposing individuals to the numbers 9 and 11 or numerical patterns containing these digits in contexts associated with negative events or outcomes, numerologists can instill a sense of fear, apprehension, or foreboding. This repetition can amplify feelings of anxiety or uncertainty, as the subconscious mind internalizes the perceived significance of these numbers. Symbolism. While numbers like 9 and 11 can have positive connotations, they also carry negative associations in certain contexts. For example, the number 9 can be associated with endings, loss, and despair, while the number May 11th evoke thoughts of chaos, instability, and tragedy. Numerologists can exploit these negative symbolic meanings to provoke emotional responses and heighten subconscious anxieties. Confirmation Bias. Numerologists can manipulate confirmation bias by selectively highlighting instances where the numbers 9 and 11 coincide with adverse events or outcomes. By emphasizing negative occurrences associated with these numbers, they reinforce existing fears or concerns, leading individuals to perceive them as omens of impending disaster or misfortune. Visual Representation Visual representations of the numbers 9 and 11 in contexts evoking fear or danger can intensify their impact on the subconscious mind. For example, ominous imagery or dark color schemes may accompany numerical patterns featuring these digits, heightening feelings of unease or dread. These visual cues can evoke visceral reactions that bypass conscious rationalization, reinforcing negative associations with the numbers. Subliminal Messaging Numerological messages involving the numbers 9 and 11 can be subtly integrated into media or communication channels, triggering subconscious responses without individuals' conscious awareness. By embedding these numbers within narratives or imagery associated with fear-inducing scenarios, numerologists can sow seeds of apprehension or paranoia, influencing perceptions and behaviors on a subconscious level. Overall, Numerology can be leveraged to exploit individuals' innate psychological vulnerabilities, amplifying negative emotions and fostering a sense of impending doom or calamity associated with the numbers 9 and 11. By capitalizing on fear-based responses and confirmation bias, numerologists can shape subconscious perceptions and behaviors in ways that align with their intended narrative or agenda.